You have such contempt for me. Kid, you worked hard for it. It's yours. The way you pawn me at parties. Now affection is contempt. Upside down. Everything upside down. Feeling me up in public is not affection. Will you come on? I know I sleep all day. I know I'm doing a terrible job, but you're not helping me any. And who helps me? I help you. Your kind of help I can do without. Can you? Can you really? <laughs> You'll do anything you can to ruin my day, won't you? I got up today feeling so good. You couldn't leave us alone. You were doing so well. What? At one time, at one time, it was great what we had. The kidding around, it can't have a natural time span. Affairs can't dissolve in a good way. There's always got to be poison. I don't see why. I really don't see why. Jonathan, do you want it over between us? Why does it have to be one way or the other? You don't want me to leave. I want you right here where you belong. What about you? When I'm here, I'm here. When I'm not here, I'm, I'm there. Where? Wherever! No. I'm a man-eater, a ball-buster, and a castrator. I want to get married. All right. Where the fuck is my shoehorn? This place is a mess. There's not any food in the house. Half the time you look like you fell out of bed. You spend more time in bed than any other human being past the age of six months than I ever heard of. The reason I sleep all day is because I can't stand my life. What life? Sleeping all day! <laughs> you do that sort of thing, I fall in love with you all over again. Marry me, Todd. Please marry me. You're trying to kill me. Marriage is death. Why now? Because two years ago, I slept eight hours. A year ago, it was 12. It's up to 15 now. Pretty soon, it's going to be 24. What are you trying to do? Scare me? I need a life. Get a job! I don't want a job. I want you. I'm taken by me. Get out of the house. Do something useful, goddammit. You wouldn't let me work when I wanted to. That was a year ago. Throw a tantrum every time you call and I'm not home. Look, sister, I'm out there in the jungle, eight hours a day. You wouldn't even let me canvas for Kennedy. You want a job? I got a job for you. Fix up this pigsty. You get a pretty goddamn good salary for testing out this bed all day. You want an extra $50 a week? Try vacuuming. You want an extra 100 Make this goddamn bed. Try opening some goddamn windows. That's why you can't stand up in here. The goddamn place smells like a coffin. Oh, Bobby. You don't need me. Why do you let yourself in for this kind of abuse? Walk out. Leave me. Please leave me. God's sake, I'd almost marry if you'd leave me. You call it abuse. You don't know what I'm used to. With all you're carrying on. To me, you're a gift. So what's it going to be? You sure know how to screw things up. So where does that leave us? Are you giving me an ultimatum? Is this an ultimatum? Answer me, you ball-busting, castrating son of a cunt bitch. Is this an ultimatum or not? Because if it is, I'm going to tell you what you can do with your ultimatum. I'm going to tell you what you can do with it. You can make...